Tyler, Tyler, have you looked at your view count yet? Not really. Why are you saying that? Well, you better take a look, because the numbers are skyrocketing. Okay, let's take a look here. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, oh, oh my god. <laughs> you are right. I just hit 2 million views. Okay, so it's time to do a 2 million views special. Told you so. Alright, let's do this. Tyler M presents the 2 million views rare and special. Hope you enjoy it. Alright, everyone. Today we are back at Snyder Rest, my one on the Houghton sub. You can see here. You can see that there's an eastbound train leaving Mac Yard right now. Probably CN M372 or something like that. Not sure which is leaving. That was actually CNX368. An actual one mixed train going from Trotter to Garner Crew back. And we got some machines on the tracks right down there. And right here, there's actually a, um, this train is actually loading up old, um, wood onto a small flatbed. Which is really interesting. This excavator, I should say. And there's a high rail over there, too. And there's an eastbound train leaving Mackyard right now. And right now, we have been the high rail truck, the signals are all red. And there's another one down there, too. So this line is, might be closed for a while, but at least there's still trains can go onto the other tracks here. Alright, I'll pause for now until our train shows up, and before we begin, please make sure you give it a really big thumbs up too. Alright, I'll pause for now, see you in a bit. And there goes the excavator going down with a small flatbed you can see here. Interesting how it does that. And the eastbound is still going right now. Hi, a possible now. And there goes the highway of truck and it looks like CN we got our first local train of the day coming our way. And that's CN L559. Interesting. I guess the machines are going down here to do some more work. And the eastbound is still going. Like I said, we got CNL559 coming. They got permission to, to depart Mac Yard. So, possible now. The first train I caught is CNL559. A local train going from Trotter to Brampton. And then it works around the Brampton Spurs. The first two units on this train are two XGATX GP38-2s. And that being 4902, trailing second is 4908. And trailing third is 4131, a GP9RM. And 559 has eight freight cars, five tankers, and three grain cars.
Norman Raider, CN M377, which goes from Montreal to Toronto, came into Mackyard with 8933 and 2551. During the same time, the highway of vehicles came back. They were clearing for sites of the tracks. After that car was unloaded, they moved out of the way for the next train. Due to the work on the tracks, I had to wait over an hour for the next train to show up. And that CNQ-101 heading east to the Bella Sub. Going from Brampton to Rubberbanks, BC. It was led by two newer X Series X Gvos. And that being 2791, which the engineer gave me a K5HR horn salute. And for a rear DPU, it's 2795. And that has 140 rail cars and 372 axles. And just by coincidence, after that train cleared, CN M314, which goes from Winnipeg to Toronto, also pulled into Mac Yard. It has 3,015 trailing second, which is the veterans unit. But however, I don't know what was leading. But it was a GFO, so it doesn't really matter.
And look at that, after one or one passed, CN M314 is pulling into Mackey Yards right now, you can see here. With 3,015 trailing seconds, and I believe 3844 leading. That was Great it. Round. Too bad it's not on the intermodal train heading to Brampton, but at least I got to see it in the distance. Great ground. That was a close call. Won't be a lot more worse if it came where 101 shows up. But I glad it showed up after 101 came along. By the way, 314 is going from Winnipeg to Toronto. So yeah, not much trains are going by here. This is only the second train I saw here going by. I'm not counting the trains in the distance. That's pulling into Mac Yard. Alright, I'll pause over there until the next one shows up. See you in a bit. So there goes CN, M314 entering Mac Yard, you can see. And I just got word that CN A451 is also coming. They just got the clearance to leave the yard, so that should be coming out soon. I'll pause over now. And we also got an eastbound coming too, so the whole time is going to get more busier now, which is good. So I'm going to pause over now. Yeah, CN A451 was the next train to leave Mac Yard. It was heading from Toronto to North Bay. So 451 was led by 2544, 2246, and DESX 27. That's actually what the blue switcher is. It's actually heading up to Sotbury. I was expecting to see a switcher on 451, so it was definitely a surprise for me. And that 451 was shorter than usual because it only has 40 freight cars. What was that unit? I know 2544 is leading because um, they called their 2544 East to the Bella Sop. Like, holy man, I wasn't expecting to see a switcher on 451. Like, that, wow, that's really cool. <laughs> Good thing I caught that. I'll pause over now. Temperature 2. That was 101's hot box. So report. there goes CN, A451, you can see here. A shorter train than usual. With that switcher trailing third. And over there, we got an eastbound coming, you can see here. So we got a train coming already, that's good. Our third train of the day, I should say. Well, I'm not counting, like I mentioned, I'm not counting other, other trains in the distance that are leaving Mac Yard heading east. I apologize. By now. then, the hot and sub was getting more busier. The next train I caught is CNA 422, going from Port Robinson to Toronto. It was led by 8928, and trailing second is 2297. And that has 151 freight cars. And if you're enjoying this video so far, then please make sure you give it a really big thumbs up.
Now on later, along came CN M301. Going from Toronto to Winnipeg. It gets to Winnipeg by going through the states. It was led by 2321, and trailing second is 8008. A. Thunder! SD70 M 2. And 301 was really long because it has 176 freight cars.
Auto CN M301 went by. We got a restaurant in the motor heading our way. And I think that CN Z121. So here we comes right now. Let's see what it has. That was indeed CN Z121. Going from Halifax, Nova Scotia to Brampton. It was led by 3040. And the engineer gave me a bell salute. Trailing second is 3884. A 100-year anniversary unit. And for a mid DPU is 3848. And 121 was extremely long because it has 223 rail cars. And by the way, a fan named Nico actually showed up where the train was passing.
While farewell cars were going under the signal, they shook a lot. Not long later, the highway of vehicles came back to do some more work. After getting something, they came back once again, and the excavator driver actually gave us a home salute. <laughs> Just before the high rail truck came back, the hotbox detector went off for another train. The next train we caught is CN Z114, going from Winnipeg to Brampton, and it came from a Bella Sub 2. It was led by 5714, which is a SD75i. But get this, 5714 doesn't have a mechanical bell. Instead, it has an Eggyrear E bell. One thing for sure, seeing Eggyrear E bells on SD75i's will not work out really well. Anyways, trailing second is 8880. And that has 90 rail cars and 264 axles.
The next and final train that we caught is CNL529. Another local train going from Toronto to Etobicoke. It was led by 4798, a GP38-2W. And the engine will give us a P3 horn salute. And trailing second is 4710, a GP38-2. And that has 9 freight cars. 1 grain car and 8 tankers. Well, if you want, we were literally going to stay out for CNA-435 because I heard him on the scanner. But, however, he is taking way longer to get out of Mac Yard than I thought. So, because of that, I'm not going to see him. And I ran out of time as well, which honestly really sucks. I got word that it's 88-82 leading on 435. At least it's just a regular st 70 m dash 2 but I'm hoping that... Something not interesting is trailing second on it. But oh well. All the red, all the signals are still red, you can see here. But oh well, it is what it is. Well, if you want, I really hope you enjoyed our trip to Snyder Rest today. If you enjoyed it, then please make sure you give it a really big thumbs up. And if you haven't already, subscribe for more videos. And, and also, a shout out to my friend Nika because... He actually came along to Snyder Rest with me. So, yeah, it's really nice to meet him today. Anyways, until my next Ray of video, I will see you guys later. And also, thank you so much, everyone, for 2 million views. I really appreciate that. Cannot believe that it's been over a year since I hit 1 million, and now I hit 2 million at last. Anyways, until next time, I will see you guys later. Peace out, folks, and have a wonderful evening. And that will be it as usual. See you later, guys. Very fun. I really hope you enjoyed our first night of rest trip of the year. If you enjoyed it, then you know what to do. Please make sure you give this video a really big thumbs up because it will help me a lot. And if you haven't already, subscribe for more videos. And a shout out to my new friend, Nick Hart, because we actually joined along with me. So, yeah. Really nice meeting you guys. Anyways, until my next Marathon video, I will see you guys later. And also, thank you so much everyone for 2 million views. I really appreciate that. Alright, until next time, see you guys later. Peace out folks, and have a wonderful evening. See you later guys.